Mr. Speaker, I rise today to recognize the centennial anniversary of the Jewish Center of Jackson Heights by sharing some of their rich history in New York's 14th Congressional District. The center was founded as the Queen's Independent Society in 1920, when a few Jewish families looked for a safe space to congregate in Jackson Heights. The center was first called the Queen's Independent Society because the term Jewish was not permitted at the time. The original building itself was based in Woodside, an adjacent neighborhood to Jackson Heights, because at the time, Jews were not welcome in the neighborhood of Jackson Heights. However, in 1928, the center was able to rename itself the Jewish Center of Jackson Heights, and in the 1950s, they officially moved their brick and mortar into the neighborhood that they are housed today. Today, the center is known in the community as an inclusive and accepting space, hosting a number of diverse community events throughout the year, as well as housing our beloved Queen Center for Gay Seniors. Mr. Speaker, I ask, I ask our colleagues to join me in recognizing the Jewish Center of Jackson Heights. Thank you for your ongoing service to our community. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.